Hello and welcome to another GCSE Geography Help video. We're still looking at development and how we measure development and it's the last measure HDI. So what is HDI? Well HDI or the Human Development Index is a composite measure and composite means it considers more than one variable. HDI considers GDP, which remember is gross domestic product or wealth, life expectancy and education. It then ranks countries on a 0 to 1 scale. 0 is undeveloped and 1 is developed. So the advantages of using HDI as a measure is because it's a composite measure, it is more accurate than other measures so it gives a realistic measurement of how far a country is developed and also because it's given as a number on a scale from 0 to 1 it is very easy to compare with other countries however there are some disadvantages not every country publishes the data needed to calculate HDI now I don't know if you can see it on this map but Somalia on the east coast of Africa is grey and that means when they made this map they didn't have enough information from Somalia and from their government to add them on to the map and also it doesn't show aid from developed countries so there could be a country in say for example sub-Saharan Africa where they're not doing too bad and that's because a nice country from say Europe has given them lots of aid so they're actually perfectly fine and developed but they appear red or orange on the map making them appear undeveloped so that's all of the measures of development next time we're going to be looking at some case studies so see you then